Now, we will see some of the graphic rating scales. These rating scales are a very good tool for quantifying the attitude of an individual. So, here the scales in which the point varies right from 3 points to 11 points with the different variations. So, we will start with the first scale that is a 3 point scale. Uh, here we have taken one particular question that is related to the mobile handset. We like to know the attitude of an individual about the mobile handset in general. So, the first scale in this case is that the person or the respondent has to rank the mobile handset they wish to purchase and they have to mention their order of preference that is a first preference, second preference and third preference. So, based on this preference we will able to have some information, some inputs about the attitude that individual holds about the different objects in this case and this object in this case is a mobile handset. This is another example of the 5 point verbal scale where I have mentioned that I will prefer to purchase the same brand of mobile handset in subsequent pur uh, purchase. So, here the option in this case is definitely yes, most probably, probably, may be or may not be and definitely no. So, this is the example of the 5 point verbal scale where again depending upon uh, the option that has been uh, selected by the respondent will able to judge some of the attitudinal information of an respondent. Uh, the next is the 5 point verbal scale where the question is the mobile handset I have, had, I have is one of the best brand. Again these options are like agree completely, agree somewhat, do not know, disagree somewhat and disagree completely. So, this is another option of the 7 point verbal unbalanced scale. So, here we find that is most of the options that has been uh, uh, been asked about the mobile handset like the excellent, very good, fair, not so good, poor and do not know. So, this is the example of the unbalanced scale where we have not given some neutral points so that respondent will able to judge that where the neutral uh, opinion about that particular object. Uh, if you want to have another variation, we can be balance, we can balance this particular uh, scale by including some neutral, neutral points in between the scale options. Like in this case, we find that is, uh, if you see the question, now these questions have these options. So, the first three options is been the options which is been positively talked about that particular object. The fourth option in this case is the neutral and the fifth, sixth and seventh options are uh, the options which is more talking about the negativity of an individual towards that particular object. Now, uh, let us go to the next uh, scale. So, here now we have increased the number of points in this case these points have been increased to the 10 point uh, numerical scale, where you are using some adjectives in order to associate that particular objectives about the opinion of the respondents. So, here your opinion of the product features or the brand of mobile handset you have. So, it varies in this case that is uh, 1 to 10. So, 1 is basically uh, for the opinion when he find that his mobile handset is having the poor quality features. And the 10, the number that is indicating that the mobile handset is having best or, or the excellent features. So, depending upon the opinion about the handset he has, he will try to judge where he like to, which particular number he like to select. Suppose, he is very much satisfied with that particular uh, mobile handset naturally he will like to give the score that is 10, but if he is dissatisfied with that mobile handset he will give the score like 1, 2 and 3. Now, in this case we will try to balance the scale by including the 0 point. So, this is the example of the 11 point numerical balance scale, where again we find that is these numbers that is minus 5 is indicating the negative opinion, 
where we are using the objective like poor and the plus 5 is a adjective which has been used for excellent opinion about that particular product. So, in this case we have asked about the opinion of the product features of the competing brand means the person who is having some brand. So, we would like to judge that what is his opinion about the features of the competing brands. Suppose he find that his product is superior than the, uh, the competing products naturally he like to give the numbers like 4, 5 likewise. And suppose he find that the brand that he is having is having inferior product features he try to give the numbers like minus 5, minus 4. So, this is what is our objective of the measurement scale that we try to quanti uh, quantify the attitude of an individual. 